this tutorial, we will show you how to create photo slideshows with PowerProducer and use the built-in PhotoNow software to enhance your photos. Select Produce Movie Disk, then the type of disk you want to burn your photo slideshow on. Let's choose DVD. Remember that you'll need a DVD burner as well as a DVD recordable disk if you want to make further edits to your DVD in the future. For a photo slideshow, simply select the first item, DVD Video. Then a capacity up to 8.5 gigabytes. And the best resolution, 16 by 9. Click Next. You can now import the photos you'd like to use in the slideshow. They'll instantly appear in the tray at the bottom. PowerProducer can also import your raw format photos. PowerProducer offers you several ways to configure your slideshow. You can alter the duration of each slide, the length of the entire album, automatic pan and zoom, and also add in some state-of-the-art transition effects. Click the play button to preview your settings. You can also check backup photos on disk to archive all your original photos on the same disk you will burn your slideshow on. If you need to edit your photos, click the relevant thumbnail in the tray, and then Photo Editing. Your photo instantly opens in PhotoNow. PhotoNow provides several editing tools. For example, you can manually fix the brightness, contrast, saturation, but also crop, and add special effects like pencil sketch, spotlight, and monochrome tint. When your editing is done, close photo now. Your edited photo automatically reopens in PowerProducer. To set a particular photo as your slideshow thumbnail, simply click the Set as Title button. You can delete photos, or reorder them. What about adding some background music? At the top, click Set Background Music and import your music file. You can add an auto-repeat or a crossfade and trim your audio to your taste. Click OK. Finally, give a name to your slideshow. And when you're satisfied, click OK. You can enhance your photo slideshow by adding a customized menu. Click Menu, select a template, then Apply to current page. Click OK and preview. Click Next. You are now ready to burn your photo slideshow. Give a name to your disk, configure the burn settings, and click Burn. In the future, if you want to edit your photo slideshow on the disk, you can select Edit Disk. You can also share your photo slideshow online. Select Disk Utilities, then Export to file. 